do all that? Why not? Are you seriously asking me why not? Yes, Lara. People too can afford it. I can't afford it. I owe money. Last time we spoke, you told me you had paid them all off. Just left with one. I can't be footing the bills when he complains about my job. He complained. Do you know he got so mad that I got home late yesterday? You did get home late. No, I didn't. It was just to eat. See, he should find the money to run the house. No, I see why you don't want to foot the bills. You are mad at him. I am not mad at him. See, I can be paying for everything, Aaron. If I start doing it now, only God knows what next I will have to pay for. But you should support your husband. Aaron, I know what I'm saying here. You don't understand me. Gibby has been a great husband to you, right? Yes, he has. But he doesn't support my business, Harry. Whenever I ask for money, he always gives me excuses. And now he wants me to foot bills from the money. No way. Lara. He can say anything he likes. The only person I'm worried on is just my son. I will pay his fees and that's all. What about his feeding? He won't be hungry. But you see, Gabriel, he will be the one to take care of his mom and also pay Helen her salary. After all, he's the one who employed her full time. When the mother in law going back? She doesn't want to go back, Harry. No one is even saying anything about her going back again. And me, what can I do? Helen! Good morning, sir. What are you doing here? I brought you breakfast to eat. You didn't have to do that. You know Harry would be angry if she knew you entered the room. You know her. I really want to, but I realize she loves to start cooking, that's why. Thank you. Is everything okay, sir? Why would you think everything isn't okay? The way you are looking, sir, you look somehow, sir. I am fine. Just a little bit worried. Sam, no matter what you are worried about, I'm sure it will pass off eventually. Yes, it will. Thank you. Please, try to eat the food. I will. What do you make? I'm sorry, sister. I know. I am sorry, too. I did everything. I followed all the doctor said. It's not your fault, Suzanne. I know how much you wanted the baby so much. I'm not meant to have a baby. You have a baby, sister. I'm so sure. I don't know why this happened. It's me, Susan, not you. I am pained, sister. Really pained about this. I know, and I'm sorry I made you feel this way. I'll do it again. I'll carry the baby again. No, I'm done getting my hopes up on all this. And I'm sorry I made you feel this. So, this is how you felt all the time you lost the babies. Yes, Susan. I've lost track of how many times I tried having a baby. I think I'm done with this now. What does this mean? It means I'll allow him to have another wife. Are you serious? Yes. You should rest, Susan. I'm sorry, man. Why does this keep happening? I don't know, man. We could carry out further research by sending samples to the main lab. Have you even done that before? We can try another new laboratory. I was hopeful that we do have a child. All hope isn't lost. We can still try again. I don't think so. Stanley, I think we have enough of with all this trial mail. Okay, I get it, man. I'm sorry. I think we have enough with all this trial mail. Susan needs lots of rest. Yeah, I should go and meet Ada Obi and Susan. Okay. The food will be yummy, I'm sure. You will love it when you eat it. I'm not even really hungry. Lost my appetite already. Sir, please try to eat, please. Helen, I lost my job. Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. I'm sorry. Yeah. I understand why you are this way then, but sir, you can't get a good job if you don't eat well. You need to eat. Thank you, I will. I'm sure you'll get a better job soon, sir. Amen, thank you. I will leave now, sir. Thank you, Helen. I should go to work. I shouldn't spend all the day at home. And for Lara, we will still continue this conversation. I'll be fine. I know. Thank you, Joy. What are you thanking me for? I didn't do anything. You offered to help me and that means a lot to me. That's what friends are for. I wish I can help more. You've tried already. Once Susan is back to her feet, I would make sure we do it again. I don't think so. Why not? I'm done with all this, Joy. I'm done. Okay. I should be heading home. What for Stanley? No, he will meet me at home. Are you okay, Ada? I'm fine. I'm good. Let me come with you so we can talk. No. Your sister needs you. She just lost a baby and she's going through a lot. You're also going through a lot here, Ada. I'll be fine. Ada! You see, he left the house because of you. Mommy, I don't think it's because of me. It's because of you, Helen, believe me. Okay, Mommy. 
You want to start heading home? Yes, ma, I do. You're going to have a place in this house, believe me. Ma, there's something else. What's that? The first stuff in the kitchen are finished. Finished? Yes, ma. Everything is finished, and I've told Madame about it. Okay, and what did she say? She said okay. Don't worry about that. By tomorrow, you will see everywhere stocked up. Okay, ma. Goodbye. You're leaving already? Yes, ma. I'm done with my job for today. So you won't stay a bit with me? I have something I need to go and do at home, ma. That's why. No problem. Make sure you call him when you get home, okay? Okay, ma. No wonder they were arguing this morning. I'm sure it's on something related to money that caused the argument. Why does it keep coming to my mind? Why? Why? Why did I even act the way I did? Why? I'm sorry, ma. What is it? I, I'm sorry. It's nothing, ma. Talk to me, Chris. What do you want? I'm sorry about the way I shouted. I wanted to ask for permissions to close early. Why? My lady's in the hospital and it's an emergency. Okay, you can go. It's almost even closing time. Thank you, ma. I'll try to come back before we close. Don't worry. I'll close the mall today. You may leave. Why can't I help him? Why don't I want to help him? Joy, I'll be heading home now. Adobe is in the broken face again. I know, but she'll be fine with time, Joy. I'm sorry about what happened. Yeah, I'm sorry too. I would have waited if Susan would be discharged, but I need to go and be with Ada. Make sure she's fine. I understand. Thank you. Please watch over her for me as well. Please. I'll do that. Don't worry. Hey, baby. I'm sorry I couldn't come as soon as you called. I'm happy to see you, Chris. What is wrong? What happened? It's Susan. She lost her baby. Oh my, what? I'm so sorry. Yeah. Where is she? She's in the room. She will soon be discharged. I've been here since morning, Chris. I can see you are stressed. Have you had something to eat? No, I haven't. The least thing on my mind is food. I just need to be sure she's okay because if anything should happen to her, I'll blame myself. Nothing will happen to her. Hey, baby. Hey. The baby is dead. Our baby Stanley. I'm sorry. Why? Why is all this happening to me? Why? My love. My queen. I don't want all those names. Stop it. Ada, please. Calm down, okay? My baby is gone. Why? 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 My baby. Did she kill the baby? No, Ada. She didn't. Then why? Why did she lose the baby? Didn't Dr. George say this was going to work? He said he was very sure about it. Doctors only make assumptions. Something you didn't write about all this. What are you thinking, Ada? Maybe she took something. She didn't take anything. Jojo, check her hand, make sure. I can't have a child, Stanley. I don't care about the children. All I care about is you and you alone, Ada. I'm not happy. Lara, is she still back? I guess she's still at work. I should go and see her dear. Son, is everything okay? Yes, mom. Everything I is fine. So you've been I'm not thinking about life, mom. I'm fine, mom. Share some of your thoughts with me. Mommy, let's just say life is filled with ups and downs. That's what makes life. Yes, mom. You're right. How's your stomach feeling now? It is much better. Told you I'm fine, didn't I? You did, mom. Kelly mentioned that the food items are finished at home. Yes, I know that. Okay. They will be available by tomorrow morning at most. Okay, son. And whatever you're going through, it will pass, okay? Yes, mom. Thank you. Don't stay out for too long. I won't. Thanks, mom. What do I get for you? Nothing. Thank you, sister. I'll make you a hot tea to drink. Thank you. They both looked so sad, sister. When I told them the news. Yeah, I know. Sister Toby said she's done with children. She's just joking, I know that. And it's all because of me. I didn't even do anything at all. No one is blaming you for anything. I know you didn't do anything. We all do. Okay. You should get some rest, okay? I'll be outside with Chris. Lara, why don't you want to go in? I don't feel okay, Aaron. That's because you're doing what you're not meant to do. I should help out at home, I know. But so many things keep coming to my head. Like what and what? What if, see, it's not really. As much as it's nothing, it's disturbing you, so tell me. I am just thinking on Helen and my husband. Come on, you're back to this again. I know I shouldn't be back to it, but it keeps ringing in my head, and I don't want to give my money to that kind of man. Lara, we should go home, it's late already. Look at the time. 
It's not that late. What about you cooking for your husband? Or don't you care anymore? Her baby has eaten already. Whose food? She won't stay cook for him. I told her already. Plus, there's no more food stores at home. Really? Yeah, I checked the kitchen and it's empty. And you're not going to do anything about it? I don't think so. Let him do it all by himself. Oh, yeah, this is my friend. Well, I need you to go home. I've got a visitor coming. Do you? Yeah, he's coming. And I don't want him to meet you here. Oh, no wonder you're looking pushy and pushy. Why isn't you here now? Susan, where are you? I'm at home. Didn't you get my message? What message? I didn't get anything. I lost the baby. What? How is that possible? What happened? I don't know as well, Helen. This is bad. Where are you? I'm at my sister's. She can't come tonight. I am coming over now. You will see me. Let's leave it to tomorrow, okay? Why? Are you lying to me? I'm not lying. Why would I lie to you? Baby, I made your favorite. Babe, you need to eat. I don't need to eat. This is one of the reasons why I don't want us doing all this. You don't care about children, right? I care about them, but this behavior that comes after things don't work out is what I don't like. Do you expect me to be happy after what just happened? I know you are unhappy because of what happened, but Ada, you got to try to be positive about it. Where is the positivity here? You can get pregnant. So I will go through all this pain again? No, no, no. Ada, this time around, it don't come with any pain. I'm not interested in any of that. Ch children? No, not interested. Okay? You should marry another wife, Stanley. I don't need another woman in my life. I've got you. Your mother needs grandchildren. You should make her happy and marry another woman. No, Hada. You are the only woman I want to be with. And I know you will have many babies. Didn't you hear me? I am not having any baby, Stanley. Like none. Ada, wait. Ada. How are you, Majesty? You're welcome. Good evening, Gabriel. Where are you coming from? The shop. Really? The shopping mall? Yes, I know I'm very late today, but I have so many important things to sort out. Where are you coming from, Lara? Gabriel, see, I am not in the mood for all those questions. I am tired. Have you had something to eat already? Or should I go and make you something? So you care about me eating? Yes, I do. You're still my husband. Lara, where are you coming from? The shopping mall. I told you already. Lara. I was there, and you weren't there, Lara. I waited for two good hours, but you weren't there. So where are you coming from? So you are monitoring me. Lara, where are you coming from? That's what I asked you. I'm coming from Aaron's place. Lara! I knew I was you. I was at her place. Is this why you have been acting differently to me? You are cheating on me. You can say all you like, April. I don't care. You don't care? Yeah, I am not cheating on you. And I've told you where I was. Oh God, Lara. What is it, Gabriel? I know why you're doing this. I know why. Why? Because I've lost my job, right? Because I don't work at the moment. So you think you can do as you like, right? You don't know what you're talking about. You have no regard for me as your husband. Just like you also have no regard for me, your wife. So this makes you think you can sleep around with men for money. What is it this time again? What is it? She's cheating on me, mom. What? I am not treating any money. Please, I need to take a bit. Lara! Lara! Open this door, Lara! When I told you she doesn't have respect, what do you usually say? I hope you can see the respect she has for us all. I'm sorry about what happened. Yeah. I didn't even know all this was going on. Now you know. What would they do now? I don't know. Adobe is still hurt by what happened, so it will take time for her to decide again. It's not easy for her to go through all of this. It's not been easy, Chris, but she's lucky to have a husband like Stanley. Yes, she is. I bet if it were you, you would have cheated on me already. I don't think so. I don't believe you. You would cheat on me and also get someone pregnant out there. My love for you is very strong, babe. Believe me. Prove it. How do you want me to do that? Do it your own way. Prove it in your own way to me. I told you not to come. I have to come see you. How are you feeling? I'm having tiny cramps. But I'll be okay. I'm sorry. Yeah. So what happens now? She isn't going to have a baby again. According to her. Really? I'm sure she didn't mean that. My sister also said same thing. So tell me what about the old plans you got? I'll find another way to actualize them. You know, this baby loss is kind of a blessing. Suzanne. 
I'm serious. It is. See, I didn't take anything, I swear it. I don't even know what to believe. You are so desperate to have him. Don't say that loud. This is why I didn't want you to come over. Just be careful. I know. Well, I've got a new plan in place. We can talk about it tonight at your place. You want me to leave already? Yes, I do. I don't want my sister to see you here. I am surprised you came out this late. She's making me feel bad. She's unhappy, man. Doesn't mean she has to act like she's doing now. You should go back home and be there for her, man. She doesn't want me around for now. Jojo, why is this happening? I told you we could run more test. I don't want that, man. Not interested. Well, I don't know. Because you're both perfectly fine. Then this shouldn't be happening. What are you going to do? I'm hoping that she get pregnant and it stays. What if it doesn't happen? Why won't it happen? Possibility of that is like a one in a thousand. What does that mean? You know what I mean. It would require a miracle for that to happen, man. That's what I'm saying. And this will keep happening for a long time. What the hell? I'm sorry, man. Hello, guys. Does this mean she might never have a child for her own? It's kind of likely, man. I'm sorry. I sent samples to the lab as I said I would. And that's what the results showed. So I and Ada will be never having children? Together, yeah. But with others, there might be a chance. I thought you were going to sleep there. Mommy, I didn't know you were here. I was waiting for you to finish bath. No, do you need anything? I don't. You know I wanted to call your mom and tell her all what you have been doing, but you said it to be quiet. Why would you call my mom? What am I doing again? You have no respect for me, Lara. No single respect. Mommy, I really respect you a lot. Don't, but I don't even need your respect. Keep it to yourself. But let me tell you a very short story. There was a woman who was very beautiful. She was admired by all and she allowed her admiration to get into her head. Eventually, she got married and got married to a very wealthy man. He supported her and gave her the best of the world. But she was never satisfied and she wanted more. Eventually, she decided that she didn't want to be with this man anymore. As she had seen someone better, she left off. But guess what? What? She didn't find better that she faced a lot of hardship there and when she decided to come back, she realized her space had already been taken. Mm, why are you telling me this story? A good wife built her home and her tears eat down. Now you are tearing your home. You are the one who is tearing down your son's home. Me? I can't marry someone else. You don't have to, man. I don't like us talking about it again. Yeah. Miracles still happen, man. I'm hopeful. My wife is cheating on me. What? She wouldn't do that, man. Laura isn't a cheater. What makes you so confident? Because I know it. Because I saw her at Aaron's place. So, she wasn't lying to me. Cheating is a deal breaker. If my woman tries that with the level of love and loyalty I've given, I won't think twice before ending the marriage. I'm fed up of everything already, man. Tired of it all. I'm also tired. But what happened? I am broke, Stanley. I can't even afford food stuff at the moment. And Lara is refusing to help me out. Really? I will send you some money so you can stock the house. Oh my. Man, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thanks. Chris, where are you? Susan, you're up already. How are you feeling? Good morning, sister. I'm fine, I'm here. I'm good. Are you sure you're fine? You know the doctor said to come back if there's any issue. I'm fine, sister. This is from Chris. I love you. <laughs> Is that what you wrote today? Yes, he has left already. No, he is outside the house. Outside? Why? Don't tell me he's washing my car. So, anywhere is really empty. Nothing in the kitchen. Good morning, ma. Morning. Where did you get the money to buy all this? Even you say he is broke. He has money. Go and join them to bring the food inside. Good morning, mommy. Go and join them. Don't quit me. Yes, ma. My son wants to be put to shape. 